Despite ongoing rumors about her husband's affair, Elizabeth Edwards is taking steps towards a new chapter in her life. With the opening of her new furniture store in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, it appears that Elizabeth Edwards has turned over a new leaf. My mother had a charity store when I was growing up. But the celebration comes amidst rumors that she isn't afraid to address. In a recent interview, she even discussed a paternity test that will confirm whether or not her husband is the father of a former campaign staffer's child. My expectation is at some point something happens. I hope for the sake of, uh, of this child that, uh, that it happens you know, in a quiet way. All this while federal investigators focus on allegations that John Edwards misused campaign funds to cover up the affair, something he wasn't open to speaking about. Doing the things I need to do with, uh, with my family, helping Elizabeth support what she's doing here. And despite even more headlines claiming that John Edwards is helping his former mistress move closer to his family's waterfront home, the Edwards appear tighter than ever. We just we have a family to run and now a business to run as well. And so we just keep our eye on that ball and just, you know, try to ignore um, what, uh, what supermarket tabloids have to say. John Edwards has not denied that he has taken or will take a paternity test to determine whether he's the father of Real Hunter's 18-month-old baby. Russ? Michelle Gillen, thank you for, so much.